Josh Kurik is an analyst at Oppenheimer, was listening in on Walmart's, Walmart's conference call. He's got an outperform rating on the stock and a price target of $175. Rupesh, what, what do you mean about the pack sizes? Why is that important? Yeah, so I think you're seeing consumers right now, you know, go towards more value with larger pack sizes. So if you're wealthier and you can afford the larger pack, you get better value. And at the same same time, lower income consumers could be squeezed just due to all the inflation out there, and they they are buying smaller pack sizes. So you're seeing on the margin some shifts to larger and small pack sizes. Uh, Walmart did not call that out specifically, but we've seen that through our coverage of consumer staples companies. What did you take away from the earnings call? Why is the stock down one percent? Yeah, so in this case, it was, a, it was just a very high expectation setup. So investors going to the print thought Walmart could do to six, six to six and a half percent U.S. comp, and they did. They did do that, and they raised guidance. And if you look at their guidance for the back half of the year, I think it was conservative conservatism. So I think investors right now are just taking prop, profits and shares. But there's really nothing wrong with the underlying report. You know, tremendous momentum in the U.S. They're doing great internationally and with Sam's Club in, in the U.S. as well. So just you know, very strong all around report. Just very high expectations going to the print. Yeah, that seems clear, uh, Rupesh. But also, I wonder what type of environment uh, is going to make Walmart work well as a stock from here. Whereas typically, it's a, it's a bit more defensive. It's when you get concerned about discretionary purchases. But here we have a, a relatively hot-running economy and also have Walmart's relative valuation up near its highs compared to things like Target and other peers. Yeah, so historically, Walmart does well when when investors are seeking defense. And right now, they're not seeking defense. But I think what's unique about Walmart going forward is next year and beyond, they can grow operating income growth faster than sales. So I think the profit delivery you see in upcoming years is going to be very strong. So that's why I think Walmart can work both in a weaker environment as, as investors seek defense and in a stronger environment, just given that you're going to see much stronger profit flow through in the coming years. A lot is being made about the market share gains as they are growing faster than peers in the category. Who do you think they're taking share from? Yeah, so in grocery, they're getting a tremendous share both in a dollar and unit perspective. So it's a lot of it's coming from conventional grocers. Think of Kroger, Albertsons, that channel, and really broad base. You know, they're outperforming dollar stores, the club channel. So it's, it's coming from many players. And I think the underappreciated part of the story is what they're doing with Walmart Plus and pick up and delivery. So on the e-commerce front, I think all their efforts is, is a key reason why they're gaining share on in grocery and e-commerce as well. Why why are they gaining an e-commerce share? What are they doing? Yeah, so I, you know, yeah. So I think e-commerce, you know, first you look at pickup and delivery. So pickup and store, I think they execute really well. In stocks are better. Uh, so I think they have one of the strongest offerings out there, and it's free pickup in in many of their stores. And then online with their marketplace, they've been adding more and more SKUs. Um, so a significant increase in their marketplace SKUs year over year. So that's also helping to drive more customers uh, engaging with their e-commerce website, and that's leading to really strong 20% plus growth in their in their e-commerce business, which is even stronger than Amazon. Yep, there, there's the chart, 24% growth this quarter. Rupesh, thank you very much for joining us with your initial take.